What's up, everybody? I'm Jace. Well, it's not a full taste of a different video today, guys. I thought I'd tell you that you read all conversations that everyone has. I'm not sure if I'm an awkward, awkward person in general, like, I have literally don't know what to do with my hands, things that I have literally shoulders like, with my hands, or. I don't know, but I always seem to have very odd conversations with people, I've got to know things like that, so. I've had some really funny odd conversations in the past, which I thought I'd just read that for you guys today's video, so. That's how I'm going to do it for today's video. Before I tell you guys, if you like to subscribe to the channel, so occasionally to the next video. Do the best walls for me in the square that's all with Rad Ball for me, so that's very weird, usually, 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 Here's how that sort of went, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys it now, and there we go. Oh. But hello there. Hello. Aren't you meant to be out on your own? Oh yes, I'm meant to be out on my own. I'm literally 16 years of age, so I am allowed to be out on my own. No, okay. It's bloody freezing today, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a bit chilly. Yeah. Do you want to wear the original while you're here? I've got plenty in my handbag. No thanks, I'm not really into whether it's original things like that, so I'm just obviously all to you. Go on, take a sweep. I know you're tempted. I know you might want to right now, you want to lose weight, but you know, it's fine to be tempted every now and then to have a word of original. I am not on Weight Watchers. Wait, you're not on Weight Watchers? Oh, that's what every young teenager does nowadays. That was wrong. Well, I know most adults and teenagers do do like weight loss courses and things like that, but I'm not doing it, so it's kind of wrong of you to assume that. So, what do you do for a living then? Oh, I literally lip sync songs on TikTok and make YouTube videos and things like that. What's a TikTok? Oh, it's that weird lip sync songs and like make comedy sketches things like that. It's really fun. That sounds quite a dumb idea to be honest. When I was your age, I had proper jobs. We worked proper 9 to 5 jobs. You guys don't seem to do it anymore. That's a shame. Oh, I'm sorry you think that way, but I feel like jobs nowadays are a lot easier. That's what I thought. You know, life back then was so much better. Now you're new lot so engrossed with technologies and computers and YouTube things like that. What's YouTube? Oh, YouTube is like an app where you just literally just record videos, like toy opening videos, things like that, and you get paid for it, and it's really, really good. So people record themselves and make a living out of that. Crikey, I do not know what this world's come to. Well, nice talking to you anyway. My moustache now because my dog Poppy keeps barking and it's making a hell of a racket. Nice talk to you too. Have a great day. That was extremely awkward and I'm not sure how to feel about it. Alright, I'll come to page number two now. So I, was, I literally worked at this like, cafe thing over the weekend. It was over the weekend, it was like a bit of voluntary work. And I come across this person who was very abrupt towards me, very rude. This customer who thought she would just be very abrupt and rude towards me, so it was very embarrassing and very frustrating, so I'm going to show that you guys right now, and here you go. Also, we don't have a till for this thing, so you just kind of appreciate this blank wall behind me, so there we go. Hi, how can I help you? I can get two Cokes and fries, please. Okay, so you want two Cokes and fries. You want the Diet Coke? Um, any other time for you, thank you very much. Just give me the Cokes, please. Quickly, come on. Right, I want my fries cooked now, please. Cook it however I want, thank you very much, because it has to cook, so I'm not sure how long it's going to take, but I'm sure it's going to be soon. No, that's the wrong change, you need to give me the right change. No, that's the wrong receipt, you need to give me another receipt, please. No. No, give me the change receipt, please. I want this in five minutes, please. Make sure you're not on the ovens and work out, please. Thank you very much. Right, well, like I said, well, after I've served you, I will cook the fries. Don't speak to me like that, please. I'm a customer at the Angelique, it's like 10 years of age. I can speak to how you want, thank you much. Can, can I just say, though, can you solve the little rudeness, please? I'm literally trying to speak serving you guys. I'm not, I don't get paid for this unless you volunteer, so if you could please not be so abrupt to move me, that would be so good, thanks. Excuse me, don't tell me what to do. I'm, you're literally like 10 years of age, so don't tell me what to do. Um, I can clarify I'm not 10 years old. Have a great day, hope you enjoy me all. He's very weird. That was very awkward. Okay, but one last one now, and this is the most juiciest one. So I was literally at like a, a store somewhere, and I had a bit of a fight with a woman, a woman at the till. Not a literal fight, but like an arguing fight. So I was literally trying to pay for the items, things like that, and this item cost like five pounds. And then this woman decided to scan it at the till, and it said it costed like ten pounds. 
but it's on the shelves, it said five pounds, so I thought, you know what, I'll just like, pay for it for five pounds, so I tried to tell him it was five pounds and she was having none of it, so here we go. Hello, can I just pay for this like, five pound and ten toy truck please? Oh my god, I paid for that, that's okay, that cost seven pound and nine please. Oh, I thought it was literally five pound and ninety nine, what are you talking about? Well, that's one of the scams, it's seven pound ninety nine, so you need to be seven pound ninety nine please. Oh, well, when I went to the shelf, it said it was five pound ninety nine, and now it's saying seven pound ninety nine here, what's going on here? Oh, there's nothing you can do about it. Well, I feel like that's misleading and I can actually have you report for that, so if it says £5.99 on the shelf, it should say £5.99 on the scanner. That's just a bit weird how you literally like, try to rip me off here. No, oh, it's £7.99, you need to pay £7.99 or else I can report you for staying Yeah, that's not the point though, you're literally trying to rip me off £7.99, I know it's probably not your fault. But I'm saying that your store is trying to rip me off because the shelf says £5.99 and it's saying £7.99 on the scanner. I'm not paying £7.99 when I could be paying £5.99 and getting ripped off. Well, if you have a complaint, you can also go to the customer service department. Duh. Okay, well, while, while I hope you have a great day, I just really hope that you learn from this and try and, like, not rip people off next time, but have a great day anyway. Well, in that case, we'll just have to just, I bought this item then, you're just going to have to get something else, because we're not going to change the shipping just for you. Your item very weird. There's something wrong with you. Alright, here we are at the end of the video, guys. But if you have liked the video, guys, leave a like to see, subscribe, shout out to the location to the next video. Don't forget to watch for me on Instagram as well, or Drab, or Flow Maintenance, right on to YouTube. Please follow it for fallback. And as well as, guys, I've been Jay's World. You can be awesome. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.